Do you believe a non-believer can go to heaven? A non-believer, as yeah. in someone who doesn't believe in Jesus. Yeah. No. Damn. Yeah. What What will happen to them? They're gonna face judgment and go to hell. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so brutal. What? You're asking me honest questions. I'm giving you Bru honest hey, answers. Hey, brutally honest. And yeah. then what do they do in hell? What, uh, yeah, what, what, what suffer consists in eternity? Forever? Forever. You don't think they should be forgiven or have, like, given a second chance? Listen. Right? Th doesn't God always give people second chances? Listen. Listen. This is something that I really struggle with. This is honestly something that I really struggle with. Yeah. And I wished, I really honestly wish that there's a different answer to this. That, oh, anybody can go to heaven. But I think what makes Christianity beautiful is that you don't have to work for heaven. Jesus already did that for you. And so the only thing that you have to really realize is accept that gift. What is, what is the gift? The gift is we're sinners and God is a holy God. Let's say, for example, we are in a courtroom, right? And God is the judge and you're the criminal. Would God be a good judge if he just said, okay, sige, wag na. You're, you're free. Like you killed someone and you're like, okay, you're free to go. But what Christianity says happens is Jesus comes in and says, okay, Will deserves to be in jail. But instead of Will going to jail, I'll be in jail for his sake. That's what Christ did on the cross. Can a, can a murderer go to heaven? Yes. As long as he's Christian. If he honestly repents of his sin. But like a person who's just a saint, never did anything wrong in their life. They're not Christian. They can't go to heaven. If they don't believe in Jesus, no. <laughs> <laughs> These are, that's brutal.